because we're just going to do another song right now. It's a game. Would you like to play with us? Okay, good. All you have to do is listen to what I say. Are you all ready? Yeah. Okay, it's already. very, very simple. It's called Follow the Leader. Come on, let's play Follow the Leader. Now you do exactly like me. First stand up nice and tall. Everybody, let me see how tall you can stand. Let me look at you all. Oh, that's good. Now you look exactly like me. Okay, you ready for one right now? Okay, let's think. Come on, let's play follow the leader. Now you do exactly like me. Put your hands on your head. That's good. Yes, that's just what I said. Can you bounce with it too? Now you look exactly like me. Okay, arms down. Let me think of another one. Put your hand on your eye. It's not hard if you try. Put your hand on your ear. You can use it to hear. Right. Put your hand on your nose. You only got one of those. And now you look exactly like me. Oh, that's very good. Let's do another one. Uh, I got it. Come on, let's play follow the leader. Now you do exactly like me. Spread your arms open wide, way out like a bird. See, there's one on each side. You're flying? And now you look exactly like me. Wave your arms in the air, way up high. Now grab hold of your hair. Not too hard, though. Now take hold of your lips. Good. Let me see you wiggle your hips. Oh, that's good. Now bend down to your toes, way down. Oh, you can count ten of those, right? Now you look exactly like me. That's terrific. Let's do uh, one more, okay? Come on, let's play follow the leader. Now you do exactly like me. Come with me through the door. Cause that's all, there's no more. And now you look exactly like me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six camels. Six. Six! By the sea, by the sea, by the beautiful sea. Oh, Ernie, smell that air. Hmm? Oh. oh, boy. Yeah, nice. Hey, Ernie. What, Bert? Uh, Ernie, uh, I don't know. You don't seem to have uh, planned ahead for this trip to the beach. I mean, I really brought along a lot of stuff, and... Uh, you don't seem to have brought much at all there, Ernie. Gee, Bert, I only brought one thing. One thing? Mm-hmm. Oh, well, I know what that must be. I brought my beach blanket, so you must have brought your beach blanket, right? Oh, beach yeah. blanket, no. Yeah. No, actually, I forgot my beach blanket, Bert. No mm. beach blanket? Mm-mm. Gee, Ernie, you, you, you're just going to sit on the sand with no beach blanket, huh? I guess so, Bert. I know, I know. You must have brought your pail and shovel like I did. See, right here. Oh. Then you have fun in the sand, huh? Oh, well, you brought your pail and shovel, huh, You Bert? must have done the same thing, huh? Well, I forgot to bring my pail and shovel, Bert. Gee, I don't have anything to play with in the sand. I, Gee, no, no I guess I didn't, I didn't plan as well as you did, Bert, no I suppose. No pail and shovel. You sure didn't plan, Ernie. Mm -hmm. 
I know, I know. You, you brought your transistor radio. I have mine in the picnic basket right here, see? You have a transistor radio yeah, in your yeah. booth? Hey, okay. turn it on. It's on my favorite station already. Just turn it on, okay? Well, let's see. Yeah, let me hear it. Oh, yeah, swing. Mm. Mm. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, dear. I didn't bring my transistor radio, and now I'm going to have to listen to your yucky music. Well, no, I didn't plan too well, Bert. No transistor radio mm. or any either? Mm. Why? I know, you brought your lunch. I had my lunch in the picnic basket. You brought your lunch, didn't you? That was my it. My lunch? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, I didn't think of that, Bert. No? Mm. No lunch either? Well, I don't know how you expected to have fun at the beach today, Ernie. No blanket, no lunch, no radio, no pail and shovel. Hey, you only brought one thing, huh, Ernie? Mm, I only brought one thing, Bert. Huh. And, and what was that one thing you remembered to bring to the beach today? Oh, uh... My umbrella, Bert. You never know when it's gonna rain, Bert. Oh no, my plank is getting wet. My lunch. Run. 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 They're juicy and healthy and cute But to eat them, it's true There's a few things to do If you want to get through to the fruit First, there's the peel problem Very tricky Now, bananas are nice With a soft, easy skin Try peeling a melon What trouble you're in a grape is a pleasure, there's nothing to do. While a pineapple's murder, let them fix it for you. Give it to mom, she'll cut some nice easy pieces up for you. Now an orange is tasty, the peel's rather thick. But don't eat a lemon, it might make you sick. And grapefruits are sour sometimes, no one knows why. And I wouldn't quite trust them, they squirt in your eyes. But a nectarine, now there's a fruit, a nectarine. Where do such things come from? Half a peach, half a plum, and very clean. You wash them so they're very clean. And be sure when you do, there's no bugs in there, too. So what do you do with a the fruit? They're squishy and run down your soup. But you really can't beat them, so bite in and eat them. Mm -hmm. They really deserve a salute. Every apple and cherry has me feeling merry. I love every strawberry, raspberry, very. I guess I'll just holler and hoot, cause that's what I do. Uh, my name is Kermit, and today I'm going to tell you about the word same. Now, same is when lots of things are not just exactly like each other, see? Now, like uh, these two things here. Now, you can tell by looking at them that they are exactly alike, so that they are the same, you know? You can uh, tell that they both have four sides, see? And they are the same size, they are the same shape, and, uh... Hey! What are you doing? Hey, you can't get away from that! Now, listen, you! I'm trying to explain about how these two things are the same, and you come along and take a bite out of one of them. Now, look what you've done. Now they're different as can be. This one here is still like it used to be, and that one over there has got a great big bite crunched out of it. So now they're not the same at all. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What? Ah. What is it? Yeah. Oh. Oh, well, look um, at that. Um, ah. Yeah. Um, well, now they're the same again. Yeah. Okay. Well, now, where was I? Oh, yeah. As you can see, these two things here are now exactly the same. No, they're no. not. What? They're not the same at all. They're not the same at all? No. Why? This one's delicious. delicious. And this one, lucky. Oh. Ah, delicious. Ah. 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 Hi there. I'm here to talk about the A box. An A box is a box that takes only the letter A. 
Simple? Yum, 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 yum. Hey. <laughs> now, sometimes, somebody tries to slip another letter into the A box. Shh. Here comes somebody now. It's a girl, and she's going to try and slip a C into the A box. <laughs> yeah, it really throws a fit. See, I told you, the A box will not accept any letter but A. Oh, boy. <laughs> yep, yeah, some people oh try to fool the A box, but I know what it likes. Good A box. Come on, boy, come on. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Oh, gee, I don't know, Big Bird. Uh, what if David doesn't have everything we want? Mm. Okay. Oh. What can I get you? We want lunch. Yeah. Oh. Okay. That's I, good. I, I, I'll go first. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'm going to have a big bowl of bird seed, a piece of bread with butter and a banana. That's a very healthy lunch. You know that. Uh -huh. That's very healthy. I'll get that in right away. Oh, okay, great. we have a big bowl of bird seed. Oh, a big bowl of bird seed. Yeah. Oh, boy. And you want bread and butter. Bread, bread and butter. butter. Okay. Bread and butter. <laughs> Bread and butter. Yeah. And a banana. A banana. A banana. Same color as me. <laughs> right, there you go. Mm. Okay, Telly, what do you have? Well, no, you probably don't have what I want, but just in case you do, I want a, a tuna fish sandwich mm -hmm. and some tomato juice mm -hmm. and a tangerine. Gosh, Ooh. what can I have if he doesn't have that oh, stuff? It's all right, Telly. Take it easy, take it easy. I got it. Mm -hmm. I got it. You want a uh, tuna fish sandwich? Yeah. Okay, let me get that. All right. Tuna fish sandwich. Mm -hmm. All right. Tuna fish sandwich. You want it tomato juice? Tomato juice. Tomato juice. Okay, let me pour that out. Okay. Tomato juice. Oh. And you want uh, tangerine, I think. Tangerine, yeah, right? Yeah. Okay, let me get it. A tangerine. Whoa. That's very good. Now, that's a healthy lunch, too. Hmm. Hey, guess what? Hmm. I just thought of something. You know, Big Bird, you ordered... <laughs> listen to this. You ordered a big bowl of bird seed, bread and butter, yeah. and a banana. Yeah. You know, all of those foods, they start with the letter B. You got it. Because Big Bird starts with B, I'm only, only going to eat lunch foods that start with B today. <laughs> what? And watch. Telly, you ordered foods that started with the letter T. Yeah. You had a tuna fish sandwich, tomato juice, and a tangerine. Yeah. So you're only eating foods that start with the letter T. Boy, David, are you smart. Oh, thanks. <sighs> okay, Jason. Well, let me. You have, let me see, your name starts with J. Jason. Okay, what le foods do you know that start with the letter J? Not too much. All I know is jelly and juice. Jelly and juice? That's not too healthy now, is it? I know. Mm. Oh, I knew it wouldn't work. We all said we were going to eat foods that started with the letter of our names. Yeah, but mm. hardly any food starts with J. We didn't think of that. Oh, mm. no. Well, what are we going to do, Jason? If you don't eat, uh, you'll get terribly, terribly hungry, mm. and you won't grow up big and strong. Mm. <laughs> Relax, Kelly. Huh? I know what I want for lunch. What? David, yeah. I really like a macaroni salad, melon, meatballs, and milk. Let's have a lunch. Hmm, well, now that sounds hey. very healthy. Hey, that is a good lunch. But meatball, macaroni, melon, and milk all start with an M, not a J. I know, but those are the foods and stuff starts for me. And me says another M. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> see that? Now that's good thinking, Jason. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Say, David. Yeah? How about a nice donut for your lunch? Donut starts with a D, like David. Or how about a dill pickle? <laughs> or you can have dumplings, huh? I've got a mind. And my mind helps me. With everything I do 
or C. My mind tells me this is a bird, and there's a second and a third. They each build homes that suit them best. My mind tells me it's called a nest. Birds can fly since they have wings, and when they're happy, each one sings. What are they saying? Without a word? My mind doesn't know. We don't speak bird. Rhinoceros. There once was a crazy rhinoceros who wished she could fly like an albatross. She climbed up a tree and said, Now, watch me! Then fell into a barrel of applesauce. Err, rhinoceros. <laughs>
interesting new show, These Are Your Parts. And now, here's the star of our show. Hi. We have a very interesting show for you today, one you're really going to enjoy. We're going to be talking to a hand. Not this hand, but this hand. How do you do, hand? Hi. It's nice to be here. Would you care to tell our audience what it is you do, Hand? Sure, I'd love to. Now, let's see, uh, where should I start? Well, I can point. <laughs> and I can call somebody. I can wave goodbye. And I can make things stop. I can also lift oh. things. <laughs> or snap my fingers. But most importantly, I can touch. All in all, I can do an awful lot of things, and I think I can say that I come in very handy. Very handy. <laughs> well, we have to go now, but I certainly hope you'll come back and talk with us again sometime. Love to. Can we shake on it? Sure. <laughs> well, I've got to hand it to you, Hand. You really know how to liven up a show, doesn't he, folks? Let's have a big hand for our hand here. Want to play a little game the Count thought up? Well, it has to do with the number, you know what it is? Six, right? Now, the Count has hidden some of these sixes back in this picture behind me. See if you can find them, okay? Take a close look. Can you find some sixes in there yet? Well, let's, let's see if we can find them together. Is that one there? No, not quite. Almost. It has a circle like this part, but no top on the six like that. So that's not one. Ah, I'm getting close. How about, how about that six right there? Did you see that one? See? Six and six. Let's see if we can find another one. Any up here? Oh, that's a bat. That's almost like one, but that doesn't have the top either. So that's not one. It's not that wheel. Ah, do you see another one right next to my six? Here it is. Right there. There's another six. See it? That's two sixes. Let's see if he's hidden any more up here. Oh, I think I see another one. Do you? Right there. There's another six. See? Same shape as this. That's three sixes. I'll bet that old count has one more in here somewhere. No. Oh, I see it. Do you see it? Right. There it is, right there. There's another six. That's four sixes. Oh, and there's six of something else in here. Did you notice those? There are six bats. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six bats and four sixes. And if the count were here, he'd probably say, I love to count bats and sixes. <laughs> Before your very eyes, I shall make them disappear. How about that, folks? Go on as promised. And now for my next... What? One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> One of those days. Ta-da! Let's hear it out there for a the fantastic magician. Oops. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, nobody's perfect. Vanished. The hand is quicker than the... What? One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, if at first you don't succeed in all that. <laughs> Another incredible feat accomplished. But now for my next... Ah! One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, that's it. I made it. The humiliation, the disgrace. I don't know what you should I should have been a gardener like my mother wanted me to be. Hey, Ellen, what are you doing? <laughs> 
Sometimes I want to get away Off someplace where I can play All by myself Well, why not? Sometimes I just need the time To think about stuff while I'm I do it a lot Well, why not? Oh, holy baloney, hand me that hammer, would you? I don't know if we're going to do it at all. All right, Frank, she, 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 quiet, quiet, knock it off. Please, quiet. Uh, Mr. Chatterley, Mr. Chatterley? Mm, yes. Are, are you ready? Quite ready, thank you. Fine. <clears throat> And welcome to another of our little alphabet chats. This evening's letter is that wonderful letter, the letter R. There it is, that's the way it looks. And you'll find the letter R before many of our favorite words like rake, rubber, ramada, radiator. Ra ra what? Guys, radiator. radiator. No, 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 no. I, I, I didn't order that radiator. I didn't order it. Don't put it there. Don't put it there. Put it over here. Do you want it? Right here. Oh, no. Oh, 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 my foot. Get that radiator out of here. He don't want the radiator. Oh, oh, here. 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 broken. Oh, oh, my foot. Oh, oh, where was I? Uh, oh, yes, yes. <clears throat> the lovely letter R. There it is, yes, we'll find this lovely little letter before many of our favorite foods, yes? Like radish. There's one, yes, coffee, radish. And uh, donuts, this, what coffee, is this? Donuts. I didn't order that, no, uh, uh, Raisin, yes, raisin. Uh, raisin, uh, no, sorry. Uh, Got a nice uh, apple tart here. No, 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 I... Uh, oh, how about oh, a prune danish? Oh, oh, beef, roast beef, roast beef. Roast There's beef. R, and no, uh, ragu, no, no, uh, uh, no, raspberries. No, no. Uh, Excuse me. <laughs> what? You see, I was in the neighborhood, and I heard that you were using the letter A-R R today. R, it's letter R. It's the letter R, R. The the letter R. 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 yes, and we are. And I decided that's... I would come by and offer my services, because, you what? see, I'm a rooster, and that's a lovely R word. Rooster? rooster? You're not a rooster. Yes, oh, sure, listen to this. Cockadoodle moo. No, 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 no. I wouldn't buy that. Oh, no. Well, I could be a rabbit then. That's a nice well, R word. I'd be a uh, rabbit, yes. Hop, hop, hop. I believe that. Like a rabbit. Hop, oh, no. hop. I believe that. Oh, no, I believe that. That's a lovely R word. the way it goes. Would oh. you like a cheese sandwich? No. No? No. Okay. Oh, well, I, I would like a glass of milk, though. Come on, come over here. Oh, surely. You can find a cow. No, 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 please. Oh. Thank goodness they're gone. Now, <clears throat> yes, the lovely R, there it is, yes, such a lovely letter. And we find this lovely letter R before many of our favorite words. Yes, the letter R is... Hey, excuse oh, me, excuse me, I have a commercial. A commercial? A commercial. No, 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 I haven't right finished here. with the letter R. Friends, is your dog tired? Does he complain oh, of no. headache, heartburn, and fleas? Oh, Does he skip ridiculous. breakfast and give him bow wow chow and oh, watch his little tail in radio. <laughs> Now see how our little doggy friend here just loves his bow wow chow. Here, boy. Here, boy. Book. Come on in here. Book. Oh. Book. This is, this is not the dog we are. Book. This is ridiculous. Book. Oh, 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 I'm going to go into a rage in a minute. Oh, why do you do this? I'm going to become rabid. Why don't you leave me alone? Why don't you have to do this? W, X, Y, Z, and A, B, C. Oh, my God. 